Thank you so much for that story. Well, we do have more stories that are beginning to come out from the people who stepped up to stop these fires. We sat down with a few Austin firefighters today, and they told us what it was like being on the front lines. And one story stood out, their effort to save a dog named Happy. It was, it was a trip to see this dog laying there, burnt paws, laying on his side and couldn't even walk. We tried to call it, and it would, it would kind of get up and just fall over. Now, when the firefighters finally got to Happy there, you see they took her to the vet, called the owner, and that turned out to be a bittersweet conversation. You know, something that I wasn't prepared for was, you know, after she knew Happy was safe, she asked me, how was my house? And it was just, I just assumed everyone knew that, you know, anybody out here's house is, is leveled. And I just had to sit there and, and, and just tell her, ma'am, I'm, I'm sorry your house is no longer here. Hard to hear. Well, Happy, thankfully, is healed, got released from the vet, and look at that. She's now back in the arms of her owner.